take a look at this. As you can see, the Power Apps job market is taking off. Companies worldwide are starting to adopt Office 365 and Microsoft Power Apps. And so this is a good time to jump on board and start to learn this new technology because you know more and more companies are looking for um, Power Apps developers right now. So what I've done is I've created a brand new course called Power Apps for Complete Newbies, which is going to take a beginner who has absolutely no knowledge of Power Apps and train them up in the skills needed to be able to create mobile applications. And once you've done this course, you know, you'll have some knowledge and you will be able to go after some of those jobs that appear in the job market for Power Apps. Now the course is online and you can watch it on your laptop, your phones, your tablets, um, however you want to do it. So if I come into the course, I can show you exactly what's in there. So here we are, it's called Power Apps for Complete Newbies. And here's the course structure. So at the very beginning, you've got a workbook, a 76 page workbook that I'm giving you. And you can use the workbook to follow along with the video training. So this workbook covers absolutely everything in the course, absolutely everything. And it makes learning much easier because all you have to do is follow the steps in the manual here and just follow through with the videos as well as you create your Power Apps. Then the video training itself, there's 21 videos. You have the introduction, uh, the plan, SharePoint with Power Apps, creating the app, adding more controls to the form, saving data with forms, adding a menu screen, using a gallery, creating and using flow, and publishing the app. But also go on to introduce the patch command, um, and that's where you can create slightly more sophisticated Power Apps by using a little bit of code. But there's nothing scary about it, and I take you through it step by step. Um, you can use the patch for creating data sources, creating screens, creating a new record, saving data, how to use multiple records. Um, you're working with a, a screen to actually um, enter software details. So I'll show you how to create that screen, how to delete from, from, from the gallery, how to add a record to the gallery, and finally how to put the app live. So in this particular video towards the end of the training, I show you how to put the app that you create onto a mobile device so you can use it on the go. Now as you go through each module in the course, you can also ask me anything here. There's a discussion area and you can ask me anything you don't understand about the subject and I will reply straight away and uh, give you any advice or further training that you need. And also, once you've completed the Power Apps training, you're going to get a certificate of completion to show that you've achieved a sound knowledge and understanding of the basics of Power Apps. And of course, you can use this um, to show to potential employers that you've, you've completed a Power Apps course. Now, as mentioned, you're also going to get completely free, as a bonus, Office 365 training. So it's covering things like licensing issues for business, home versus business pricing, um, all kinds of things here, using Office applications online, using OneDrive, Skype for Business, um, Outlook with Exchange, managing tasks with Planner, and the Teams application. So there's all kinds of Office 365 training you're getting, getting here as well as the Power Apps training, absolutely free as a bonus. So in these uncertain times, it's good to learn new skills and uh, pick up new technologies. At the moment, the whole world is switching over to Office 365 and Power Apps and, you know, gone under the days of using things like Microsoft Access. Um, people are switching to these newer technologies now and it's good to sort of learn this and put this on your resume or CV so that you can show potential employers that you have a knowledge of, of Power Apps and, and these different technologies because it can only stand you in good stead in the job market. So if you do want to join my course, there's a link below in the description. 
um, and it'll be good to have you on board. And you can use my training to apply for the many jobs which are now popping up in the Power Apps arena worldwide. If you want to enhance your Power Apps job prospects, then sign up for the Power Apps for Newbies course. Click the link in the description just below this video.